Hello everyone and welcome back to Mass Effect 3. Ding dong ding dong ding dong. Uh, oh no. Unfortunately, been really unlucky with the unlocks to the uh, packs for the new classes. I haven't. Apart from Medic, <laughs> who's playing as a Krogan Vanguard. I'm a banana. Uh, but I haven't had any yet, so all you're really going to get from me is a new map and a class I haven't really played as before. So, enjoy. I'm playing as a human Vanguard. Damn it, stop stealing shit. <laughs> I'm not stealing, I'm just getting there before you. I'm slow. But, uh, yeah, the Krogan Vanguard is awesome. I like it. Apart from the fact he takes apart your screen. Yeah, he's, he's so much bigger. Look, wait, 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 wait. wait. Where's cover? Dan, come over here, look. Look at this! I'm not covered! Oh, look at that, you can still see half of him. I can still the whole of Mount Kilimanjaro <laughs> still sticking up the top. Yeah, but they are pretty good. They have the, uh, what, Biotic Charge, Barrier, and... and um, Carnage. I'm just using a shotgun, so my powers are quick. Now what metal are we doing it on? I've forgotten already. Uh, we are just running this one on bronze, uh, because we are pressed for time. And we're oh. playing the classes that we don't usually play as, so we, we don't want to, like, fail and have to redo it. Damn rockets. Damn those rockets. And yes, of course, we have Titan with us again. No Titan. Playing, the, playing uh, as his uh, engineer. Yes, once again. It's nice having a guest. Yes, you hear that? Guest. He's not part of us. <laughs> uh, he may as well be. He's in like every video we are, so yeah. kind of that kind of qualifies him. Well, that's true. Uh, I suppose he is, except from my single less plays. He's in. Yeah. Which, yeah. Well, not except the Halo ones, so we. Yeah. Maybe. And and possibly one of our upcoming LPs. Oh, jeez. I can't, can't talk too much about You are such a tease, Danny. Mm. So I've been told. Did you just call me Dunn? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know <laughs> why. Sound right. yeah. It's like me calling you Sean. Oh, that's weird. Yeah, I know. Who <laughs> calls me Medic? Everywhere you My old school tutor used to call me Medic because no one heard me call, me call Sean. So I'm not just a. I'm not kidding. So he's shouting medic. No, <laughs> he used to say Sean the Redster, but when he used to like call me out, he just said medic. Because like everyone at my school used to call me medic. It's kind of weird. I don't know, everyone did it. Like we just went by each other's... Like Draco? Yeah, it's why Draco's Draco. You just got a mention in the video. Fuck you, Draco. <laughs> there you go. You like it. Even now, when I when I speak to Draco, I, like on Facebook, I still call him Draco, even though it says right there, Chris, yeah. like Draco. It's not, it's not Chris, it's Draco. It's his name. Malfoy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> his name's... We know Draco Malfoy. Ah, uh, but anyway. I still don't think that guy's that That window very well. He plays Draco. Tom... what's his name? Tom... I saw him in the Rise of the Planet of the Apes and I just thought he couldn't do... he didn't do very well. <laughs> I saw a review of that... Uh, today. Yeah. I still haven't seen the movie. And um... Apparently he's like a... evil guy in it again. Not so much evil as like a, a bastard. An asshole. Yeah. And he does like, it badly. I kinda of just wanna watch it for that. He doesn't do it very well. It just doesn't come off like... He says the stu- oh, they shouldn't have said the line, but they say that famous line, you know. Oh, what? Get your hands Get off your me, you damn dirty yeah. apes. Yeah, he, he says that, it just doesn't seem right. <laughs> does it doesn't seem forced. Yeah, it really does. I hate that. It just yeah, the, the review I watched said that, like, the best, um, the best, the best performer in the entire movie was the CGI ape. <laughs> <laughs> It is, the Sandy Circus is the monkey, he doesn't say anything. Yeah, he said he was by far the, the best performer of the entire movie. Which I thought was hilarious. The old man was good. The old man? Yeah. Who's the old man? He has Alzheimer's in it, that's the whole point of the monkey. That's how he got, the monkey got smart. Oh, right, because they were trying to cure Alzheimer's. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, it's not, it doesn't look like a too bad of a movie, and I kind of want to see it now after it's that good. review. It's not too bad, it's just not too great either. No. Mm. 
Well, I mean, I'm, I'm not going into it with any expectations because I haven't seen the original. So, you know, I'll, I'll be going in fresh. So it probably, I probably wouldn't be as yeah uh, as affected by it oh. if it was bad than people who have seen the original. And, and I haven't watched the original in ages. Tim Burton ones. The Tim Burton one is um. Weird. Is that the, the, that the original? No, uh, the original is like old, old. Tim Burton yeah, films where, yeah, Helen Mullen Carter's in that fucking film too. Is she? She's she is monkey. creepy though. <laughs> You look at Helen Bonham Carter, she, she looks, I mean you've seen her in Harry Potter, she fits that role perfectly, she looks creepy as hell. She didn't you know, even I like wear her. any makeup or anything, she just brought her own clothes. <laughs> <laughs> like an own clothes day at work. Yeah. What the heck? Hmm? Yeah. That guy, that medic just killed wouldn't die. Oh, look out what? behind you! What? Anyway, oh, uh, if you like the film... Should come in. <laughs> yeah. If, if you've seen it, let let me know and tell me what you think of yeah, it. Yeah, recommend it to Dan. See if he should see it or not. Or if he, have you not seen the original? No, I haven't seen the original. Oh, you should sit watch the original. Enemy down to 50%. Huh, I might. It's like was well, like it's like 50 years old now. You know, that shouldn't stop me watching a movie, yeah, but maybe. Uh, was it 60s or 70s? It's probably 70s. I mean, the last like. Um. Oh no. I, I remember. Don't you, on the other side. <laughs> I remember you talking about the Lord of the Rings anime that you called. Oh, you have to watch that. I've seen it. I know yeah. how bad it is. Yeah, I was I was flicking through the TV stations one day and I was like, oh, the Lord of the Rings. Oh. I'll watch it. And then I saw it was the animated one. I'm like, okay, I'll give it a chance. And then I carried on watching. I was like, oh my god, what am I watching? <laughs> this oh, is not the Rings. It is so camp and psychedelic, it's like they wrote it on an SD. Yeah. It honestly is. It's the, it's the part where Sam and Frodo look like they're about to kiss. <laughs> I'm not even kidding, type that in on YouTube everyone, right now. Sam Frodo, animated series kiss. It looks like they're gonna do it. I was oh. like watching it, I was like, okay, they're not gonna lean in any closer. And then they lean in closer, I'm like, oh my god, they're gonna kiss. <laughs> There is there is a moment I, when I watched the um, Fellowship of the Ring, um, like the uh, what's it called, the, uh, the like behind the scenes where they're talking about the movie. Yeah. So I'm a nerd and I do that. Um, there was like they were talking about the bit where Frodo wakes up in Rivendell. Shit, I'm about to die. Okay, and, back, bro. And, and Sam runs in. Yeah. And it was like they were talking about how. The fans had asked that, like, they wrote in to make sure that when Sam runs in, he grabs Frodo's hand. Yeah. Because it was like, it was like symbolic of something, I don't remember. Ian, it's like Ian McKellen was talking about it. And it uh, reminded yeah. Sean Aston about making sure he grabs hold of Frodo's hand. A lot of fans will be looking for that. <laughs> right. What? And you know, Ian McKellen's. Oh. He, he's gay. Yeah. I, 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 I like everything. Ian McKellen's in. He hasn't played a bad role that I've seen. I don't know, I'll probably just no, wait for a lot of time. Not even my pizza. I, uh, I, I just don't know what the... Um... Do you think? It's like, th there's obviously some homosexual tendencies played out in the, the modern day. No, no, so, no I, I wouldn't say homosexual tendencies, because you can't say holding hands and stuff is... is yeah. gay. Um, Thank you but for there's, letting there's me definitely... upload this whole thing alone, fellas. I thought it was done. Sorry. <laughs> I was going. just kidding. Thing. <laughs> you guys were running around the whole time. <laughs> I'm a Sorry. giant banana. I need to kill. I'll stop talking about movies now. I'm never talking about movies. <laughs> I don't care if you're talking about movies. I just I wanted to move away from the stage. <laughs> Tyson's just there, uh, getting more and more frustrated as we're just running around. <laughs> oh, yes. Guys, kiss. <laughs> Oh, that's <laughs> funny. Anywho, <laughs> yeah, let, let's um, let's let's switch the conversation from alien time. sex. Not this again. <laughs> you are a Krogan this time. I am. I still can't find a female. I even got a sexy bodysuit on. <laughs> banana suit. This is the Krogan's mating colors. Yeah. Some people wear banana hammocks. Krogans wear banana suits. It's just because their whole body is a penis. <laughs> <laughs> so they need a whole suit. <laughs> God. 
<laughs> it's true. You heard it here first, folks. Krogan's are penises. Well, what do you think they cover the, the hoods up for? <laughs> that's, that's like their junk. I'm gonna use Medic Jar, don't worry about it. Okay. They just like headbutt people and impregnate them. <laughs> but they headbutt everything. That's why you were swinging at me earlier. <laughs> I help it. That does explain how they populate so quickly. Just headbutt things. Yeah, like everything. It's like baby Krogan's pop out. Yeah. I can imagine when they say baby Krogan pops out, it just goes and then they're out. <laughs> like a ping pong ball? Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Nice. I've seen a female Krogan. Do you think Krogan's lay eggs? You know, they are reptiles, sort of, so maybe. They, maybe they lay eggs. And they do look like lizards, kind of. Not. <laughs> they used to eat flies, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Solarians ah. evolved? Yeah. They used to read flies. <laughs> uh, pans down one of the best quotes of the game. Yeah. If, if, if you haven't played the single player, or, or the, uh, the From Ashes DLC, where you get the new squad mates, I won't, I won't say who it is. I you need help! Know. I I'm need coming. help! I'm oh, coming! No! Not going! Not going. <laughs> Get away from him! You ah, I saved your life. Two hunters coming at me and I couldn't hit them with my uh, overload because they were invisible. Wouldn't lock on. So yeah, as I was saying. <laughs> so rudely yeah. interrupted me with something relevant. Uh, <laughs> yeah, from Ash's DLC. That should have yeah. been free. That is such a giant part of the... It is, it is a really big part. I suggest if you if you get that DLC, make sure you play it as a like a fresh campaign. Yeah. Don't don't finish the game, then get the DLC and then play it because you'll miss out on a bunch. Yeah. There's a lot of backstory in there that you'll you'll want to get, it. especially if you're into the Mass Effect uh, lore. Yeah, and if you bring them along, different people react differently to you, and yeah, it's huge. It really does change it because I did it on the same with him. Make, it makes a big difference. It does. And he delivers some of the funniest lines in the entire um, game, hands down. He, he delivered the one line which we kind of just said. Um, it made me the, chuckle. It was the one line that made me laugh out loud throughout the whole game. It was the one line that did it, and it'll be my hands down favorite quote from Mass Effect for uh, forever. No, 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 no. Mine's Shepard. Shepard. <laughs> <laughs> that's got such a fall. Oh shit, that's a prime. Oh, there's a there's actually a song which I uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna link uh, an annotation to this song that you might not have seen. It's the Commander Shepard song. Ah, ooh, ooh, that's another one. Jesus. I'll get him. I'll get him. No, Tyson. I'll just head about this prime. Did I say I'll get him? I said I'll die first. Are you dead? No, I don't. I hope now I'm dead. Oh lordy. Oh lordy! Get away from him! No! Get <laughs> 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 away from him! So I should just run away and let Dan just sort it out. <laughs> so as I was saying again, for Tyson so rudely interrupted. I got Banana pushed. Man! Do you remember Banana Man? I feel yeah. like Banana Man. The, the superhero? Did from you, those old comics? Yeah. yeah. Hey, what's his name, Banana Man? I think it was. Banana Man doesn't seem to have the same ring to it as... I remember he wore a blue suit and had like banana cuffs and banana feet. He ate bananas and turned into superhero. Yeah. But what was his name, Banana Man? Oh shit, I'm fucked. Oh, I need my... Okay. Ah, oh, no, I'm stuck between a Prime and a Hot Pips. That sounds kinky. Maybe, oh, uh, I'll heal myself. Okay, Prime well, I could have helped you. Oh, I know how Tyler feels now when he places his vanguard. Do you? You just tear shit up. Like so long as you've got a target, you're al you're alive. Yeah. Me to eliminate the target. Yeah. Hallelujah. I I barely even use my gun. I do. I just use it to clean up. 
know that. I feel like such a professional. Bye bye! He's gone for a little swim. He took a little tumble off the cliff. Took a little tumble. There's, there's a. What is it? Sorry, is it a hunter again? Yeah. Yeah. Not, I didn't want to. Oh, there you go. Whatever. Good job. Oh. My I like you. Fly. Hello. <laughs> it's a guy. That guy got fucked. Oh, How's the backpack? Tyson's is just trying to keep up with all the flying people. <laughs> <laughs> I like this Krogan. Who's shooting me? Damn, hunters. Oh, as well, if, if anyone else knows, um, there, was a, there was a patch for this game a couple of days ago. I think it was just just as the, the new DLC was released. Yeah, it was. If anyone knows if they amped up the difficulty, please let us know. Yeah. Because we're having a hell of a time lately. I don't know whether it's because we're rusty at it, or they really did up the difficulty. Yeah. But we struggle for kind rusty. of. Nobody knows the trouble I've been in. It's like you can't get rusty if you're never very good in the first place. Hello. <laughs> Headbutt for you. Uh, we got two two hunters coming. Where? In the middle. Right there. Oh, fun. Oh, a crime. Got him. I can take this guy. <laughs> ah. Ow, oh, that's fire. Set fire to the rain. Watch it burn. I hate that sound. Taking out a prime myself. I missed! I can't overload invisibles! Well, wait till they shoot me and then they're not invisible anymore. I killed a prime on my own! Congratulations. Well, like a badass. Wow. I'm sorry, did I just rape everyone? Yes. Part of apologies. I'm up, I'm speeding up. I am the janitor. As long as you, yeah. Janitor. God. I, just this. You know, just do this is amazing. Hey, Dan, as long as I want to get enemy. back. Oh yeah, I'll head back. I just don't want them closing in on us. Let's kill these pyros. A pirate didn't die, but whatever, he's low now. Here I am. He'll die in a second. I'll carnage him. I missed. I'll carnage him. You're dead. You're not dead! No, I killed him. No. Ooh, I'm gonna go dead! Ooh, I used to spec that. I killed him. That would have been funny, wouldn't it? If I'd gone down the last second and he didn't get full attraction. <laughs> That was it. Good. Ah. Well, thank you for joining us on Firebase Hydra Bronze. Hello. Oh, wait. You're saying goodbye. I'm saying goodbye. Well, <laughs> thank you for joining us. Hello. Welcome to the next episode. <laughs> uh, okay, so hopefully next episode we'll, uh, we'll have a different class for you to watch. Hopefully one of the new ones. Yeah, hopefully. 